The judge did not allow us to show Johnny Hill's face in court. Uh, there were several members of his family that were there. There were several members of the victim's family there as well. They sat just two rows away from each other, and I could hear them crying as the prosecutors described exactly how the victim was killed. Sir, I'm going to enter a not guilty plea on your behalf to the three count complaint that's been filed against you. New details tonight on the moments before security guard 44 year old Ernest Buchanan was gunned down outside of the Alpha Project homeless shelter last month. Prosecutors say video of 40 year old Johnny Hill and 47 year old Floyd Garrett from surveillance cameras as well as the city's smart street lights showed this. Both defendants Johnny Hill and Floyd Garrett arriving together. Um, waiting for the victim, Ernest Buchanan, to arrive in his truck. Both defendants shot Buchanan down in the middle of the street using two separate caliber firearms. Buchanan died shortly thereafter. Deputy District Attorney Matthew Carberry said both men used handguns to kill Buchanan and that Hill's DNA was found on items at the scene. Carberry says both defendants are members of a criminal street gang and have been linked to each other throughout the years. Hill has a lengthy criminal history including a prior strike conviction for a gang-related assault in 2010. Bail for Hill was originally set at $5 million, but Carberry requested it be doubled. Given the vicious nature of the shooting um, on a city street, uh, the past record of this defendant, um, Your Honor, I believe that a higher bail upwards to $10 million is appropriate. A judge agreed. Meanwhile, several family members of both Hill and Buchanan sat in the courtroom just feet away from each other, emotional during today's hearing. Carberry says the victim's family is coping as best they can. Um, they're obviously deeply uh, disturbed by what had happened um, so suddenly to a member of their family. And I can tell you uh, throughout the hearing today, uh, the defendant Hill, uh, he continued to shake his head uh, while the prosecutor was speaking as if he disagreed with what the prosecutor was saying. Now, motive still remains a mystery. As for that second suspect, uh, Garrett, he remains in uh, Arizona. His extradition hearing is scheduled for next week.